hey welcome back again to my new video guys this is poco f5 you guys can see with back with new video here this is the poco f5 with evolution x strong guys You guys can see Android version 15 here, Evolution X version 10.5, Android security patches 5th April 2025, which is latest one. Base button version, you can see the kernel used here is 5.10.234. ZKI kernel has been used. The build maintainer is Zoe Hope, and build date is May 1st, which is latest build available for this Poco F5 or the Redmi Note 12 Turbo build number. Also, you can see from here this is typical home screen we also get the widgets and lock screen and wallpaper and style and home settings you guys can see all the necessary features are given in this particular rom guys it's very similar to older versions of evolution x you guys can see this are the interface and this the quick settings toggles you guys can see here these are the quick settings toggles how smooth the experience i kept for 120 hertz refresh it i'll show within a while these are the quick toggles added in the main screen if you want you can add these other things also as you see on the lock screen as you can see i'm getting calls also here this is how the experience here and this is all the apps i'm using you also get the basic call recording once the call if i get or i want to make a call it will be recorded automatically once i toggle this and output format you can check out here and output director also you can check out and other options you can check out from here and the camera application you get xiaomi hyper os camera here you guys can see in video 4k 30 fps is given and in the more options you all the you all get the necessary options from here guys regarding dolby atmos again you guys can see here this is the dolby atmos once i turn on you also get a different profile here uh graphic wise you can adjust and you can save them also you get some of the presets from here you can adjust them intelligent equalizer is also there here you guys can see i kept for detailed speaker virtualization if you want to if you want to listen that 3d experience you need to toggle this on again dialog and and once you play the games or listening any news or anything like that you can keep based upon your requirement higher will be the better dialogue experience again and base enhancer is also there volume level is also there reset to defaults if you want default settings of Dolby Atmos you can reset that I turned off completely because I want to play game turning off the Dolby Atmos and Google Maps other things are working fine here we'll show some results guys results whatever I got this is file manager again see all yeah from here i can show this is a cpu throttling test you guys can see this is actually 100 threat test case maximum is 403 gaps and minimum is 257 and average is 307 gaps whatever i got it in the cpu throttling test you guys can see and this is regarding the internet connectivity using my ATL fiber connection I am using currently 100 Mbps plan and this is regarding the BSNL network guys you guys can see in the 3G which 1.7 Mbps I am not using ATL or GSN right now and this is the read write speed test results with the graphical and scores and this is the Geekbench score 1107 is the single score and 4106 is the multi score Linux 5.10.234 GK kernel has been used here and this is the anti benchmark results you can see 1 million more than 1 million scored you can see UX memory CPU and GPU and temperature raise I haven't set in the AC or air conditioned even in the air cooler not even turned on the fan guys it was kept in the room temperature currently here in Balari where I am living is around 35 degrees Celsius when I am shooting this video it will go up to 40 degrees Celsius. So that is the room temperature here. Summer is on. Device getting a little bit warm is very normal here in this case. And this is regarding the Play Store certification. Devices get certified here. You guys can see. Again, 
in the YSNAC app, the safety net test checker, it's showing something like API error, but payment applications are going to work fine. No need to worry. And again, regarding the Dolby Vision and L1 certification, that is there. No need to worry watching audit application. These are the results what I got from this particular ROM. Guys, we'll go into some settings here. I want to show some settings here. Into the settings, Evolver, you get all the basic settings in the miscellaneous settings again. You get all these necessary options, components, spoof, spoofing and all. You can check out them once you flash this ROM. Again, these are very similar to any other custom ROM. You are all already using this Evolution X custom ROM. Very familiar with this particular thing. And display, again, you get lock screen and dark theme mode. And night lights, live display, colors. Again, you can select them. And yeah, refresh rate kept to 120Hz. And adapter refresh rate is also turned on from here this is all the results and battery you guys can see battery usage how it is i used playing bgm and all the drainage is a little bit more because summer is on again and the charging speeds are also very good here you will get that 67 watt charging support in this particular wrong guys so let's see the bgm how it handles in this particular wrong yeah you guys can see here guys graphic settings are set to the maximum here possible ultra extreme and the 120 fps you will get in this particular rom guys no need to worry regarding that i turned i kept the 3.5 mm headphones yet i will increase the volume a little bit yeah now i able to hear it will be better for me to play like this as you can see that's the greatness of the 120 fps and using the wired earphones see how i can able to get better kills even in the high members whenever the Many people around me still I can able to get very good FS. But again, due to the throttling test results, you guys can see if you play continuously without calling your devices. This is how the gaming experience in this particular ROM, guys. If you have any specific questions regarding this particular ROM, comment down in the comment section. I also share some other results. Stay tuned till the end of the video. Don't skip the videos. Watch the complete videos. And people not subscribing to my channel, guys, just watching my videos but not subscribing my channel. This is the experience of Evolution X particular ROM. You guys can see the gaming experience. We'll come back here. I'll just show some. Uh, results the 3.5 mm headphone jack is working fine here if you want to use bluetooth also that is also going to work fine no problem regarding that guys and regarding the phone unlocking as you can see fingerprint unlock is going to work fine and this is the face unlock as you can see it's also working very fine i can say here no problems regarding that when signal reception everything is working fine i have not faced any issues you can check out the flashing method videos in the shorts and even in the full videos in the previous videos also check out the download link in the description please subscribe to my channel for similar kind of videos this is sampath guys you are watching sampath samfx pro channel this is we'll be with another interesting video guys until that keeps smelling by buffer now